Hi, my name is Emmanuel De Leon, and I'm gonna teach you guys a new rudiment that you probably never heard of. I learned them a long time ago down the road and can't really pick up on my head who taught me it, but hopefully you're watching, dude, and maybe you could drop me a line and tell me, yeah, it was me. No hurt feelings, but yeah, so these rudiments are called balloons. Well, this is one of those rudiments that seems to the naked eye to be very difficult and there's a lot going on, but actually when I break it down to you, it's very simple. It's basically just starting out with a basic rudiment that everybody knows, which is paradiddle diddles. And then putting them hand to hand. And then altering the accents to only be on the doubles. And then putting a flam on the downbeat. So although I explained to you exactly how the height should be in slow motion, pattern to pattern, very, being very articulate with all the height control, it's better to actually control it by breaking it down by what it actually is and going pattern to pattern, going parallel diddles, and then just breaking it down and going into no accent almost, but hand to hand back, to, back and forth. And then the third product of the rudiment itself is to start altering the accents to be only on the doubles, but it's going to get more legato with the feel. You're not going to have to control the accents and stick them out so much. It gets way more comfortable. Another easy thing to do is to break it down by stopping on just the next hand release so you can identify where the grace note is on which hand and not confusing and popping maybe as a double stop, but breaking it down and knowing what that grace note should be. And then obviously off the opposite hand. And then once you start to practice them back to back, going from fast to a slower tempo, you're going to notice that in order to achieve that faster tempo, that the flam grace note comes out of the double and creates a three stroke. And in order to get that faster tempo, it's going to become more legato. So guys, those are balloons. Hope you have fun with them. Just know that when you guys are playing these, that obviously like any other rudiment, that you are to articulate all the heights, control the accent tap, and really be very, very intricate with everything. But in order to get that, that speed, you have to start to be very legato and let it just flow out and make sure the grace notes don't get too wide because then it'll start to get very messy sounding. But otherwise, it's one of those hybrid rudiments that everybody's gonna be asking you, what the heck are those?